After coming oh so close last year, the Clareton Bears now have the gold around their necks in Hershey as they win their first ever state championship. It's overtime on WNPV1440.com. Alongside Dan Morehouse, I'm Kyle Berger. 15 to three, the Clareton Bears winners today over the Bishop McCourt Crushers. Dan, it was uh, anybody's game going into the fourth quarter and uh, Clareton really put it away. Nobody thought it would be 3-3 at half and nobody thought we'd have to wait till the fourth quarter to see a touchdown, but that's how it went. Clareton uh, capitalized on a fumble turnover by Bishop McCourt. They were able to score on a plunge, and then they got the uh, incredible 80-yard run for the insurance touchdown from Deontay Howard a little bit later. Tom Nola's team winning their first ever state title. Having been to the final last year, the coach told us after the game, it was that much sweeter to win it this year. The harder of our players, I believe they were bigger and stronger. But our players just got a lot of heart especially on defense. The man with that 80 yard run, Deontay Howard, although he scored, Dan said that this team hung their hat on their defense. Kyle, this was a team that gave up an average of 3.9 points a game, and that's with a loss. They lost their opening game to Laurel 15 to eight. They have a tremendous defense. I think they were helped out too by the fact that Bishop Accord had a very conservative uh, game plan. The, the forward pass really is not in their arsenal. They kind of played into the hands of the defense of Clareton. As Deontay Howard told us after the game, it may be a cliche, offense wins games, but defense wins championships. Defense, we take pride in playing defense. And Clarion defense wins championships. And we showed that down Hansfield and we showed that here today. So I give my hat off to the defense. The defense was a hero today. An emotional day here for Clareton last year, uh, tears of sadness and earlier this spring, tears of sadness with an assistant coach who was tragically killed. Tears of joy today though, Dan, for the Clareton Bears, a nice win for the program. You could just sense the satisfaction in the kids. They weren't cocky about it. They just felt good about getting the win. They came oh so close last year. Today they got the deed done. So it's the first of four state championships, and it goes to the Clareton Bears out of District 7, 15-3 winners over Bishop McCourt. That'll do it for this edition of Overtime. For Dan Morehouse, I'm Kyle Berger. We'll talk to you later on this weekend.